because I look super dark. You know, it's fine. More melanin. <laughs> okay. Oh, Shall I like put a brush on you? <laughs> Where's that? Where's that lamp? <laughs> no, but it's not gonna. I'm gonna just carry it like this throughout the whole video. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Beauty B, and today I wanted to hide so I can. <laughs> Hey guys, it's B Certified here at Cheap again. Well, not again, because it's my first time here today. <laughs> but today I am taking over Beatrice's um, video, and today we are going to be doing the Ghana tag. Now, if you're not familiar with the Ghana tag, it's basically just a whole bunch of questions regarding Ghana and us. Um, now, before we get started into the video, make sure you follow us on all our social media. It will be in the description box below. But until then, um, stay tuned for the questions. So the first question is, when was the last time you were in Ghana? I was actually in Ghana um, two years ago for my, yeah, it was like the, it was last winter for my sister's wedding. Shout out to her. Look up the video is Alfred Wed's Amelia. It's going to be in the description <laughs> box below. You're going to see it. The last time I was in Ghana was literally 2002. Ooh. Second grade. I haven't Ooh. been back since then, so it's been a long time. Like that. <laughs> that one, that one. But I do want to go to Ghana for Christmas this year. So Am I invited? <laughs> Question number two: Where do you live in Ghana, and what tribe are you from? Okay, my mom has a house in um, Sunyana, and then my dad has um, his house in Wamnafo. But we were. We're originally from the Mayan Crows, so like we're just everywhere in the Punahapa region. All right, well, I'm totally different from her because, like I said earlier, I haven't been to Ghana in so long, but from what I do remember, um, I live in Accra. Of course. Um, Every Ghanaian says that they live in Accra. They're from Accra. Okay, do you speak your language? Yeah, I speak it fairly well. That's all I speak at home, so I'm pretty good at it. Is that a beehive? Whoa! Is Beyonce coming on? <laughs> <laughs> that Becky with the good hair comes in. I, I do speak the language. Um, I'm currently trying to learn my mom's language, which is Adon. So the only thing I know is Kacheke, which means how are you? <laughs> What's your favorite Ghanaian food? I have a slight obsession with yams, so <laughs> cooked or fried, mostly fried, and yeah. Yeah, yams, yams, which is jollof, um, anything spicy. Totally opposite from her, I'm not a big fan, I'm not a fan of spicy food, which is really rare for an African because yeah. that sounds beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But um, I would definitely have to say my favorite food is a talk. <laughs> I love it so much, let me tell you. I thought it's my favorite food. Um, <laughs> you eat with the peanuts and the eggs? No, not the peanuts, just the avocados and the eggs. No, jollof be rocking the Wait, no, Basically. not Nigerian jollof. <laughs> yeah, that's poison right there. We like to live. <laughs> no shade, no tea, no shade. What around your house represents your culture or country? But I have this, which says Aquaba at the top. Um, basically means welcome. welcome. <laughs> basically means welcome. If you're African and if you have an African friend and you see one of these, you know they actually ask. It's like hanging out. Like as soon as you walk into the house, it's usually right there. Yep. So it's a time. It's like a clock. <laughs> Everybody got one. For my artifact, I have this. Um, it's a pencil holder. It's really weird. That's a pencil. Holder? <laughs> yeah, you put the pencils in the little holes. That's so cool. <laughs> I got it in Ghana when I went three years ago with my mom, and it says "Greetings from Ghana, the land of gold." So shout out to my Gold Coast. Hey, what ridiculous question you've been asked about your country? Um, do you guys live in huts? I think when I was like in high school, we were in art class, and this kid was like, "Wait, how are you gonna ask me? How are you gonna answer my question?" Oh, I'm sorry. So it's a ridiculous question, and also like, do you speak African? 
Well, if you're uh-huh. dumb, you would know that I'm African is not a language. But you know, yeah, no shade, no tea. Yeah. Every time. But story time for real. It was um, I was in art class, and this kid was like, so I heard like people in Africa when it's like I don't remember what year. I think let's just go 18. He was like, when it's like your 18th birthday, you get to go out and like um, kill a lion for your birthday or something. What are some of your favorite Ghanaian sayings? Um, definitely have to be. Yeah. <laughs> Kinda. That was really cute. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, like I said, it's you know about pampa. So if I say it in English, it'll be like, "That's not why is that your favorite?" It just means your forehead and the top of your head. But. My favorite saying. Don't you? No. My favorite saying has to be um, "Do fiasa." I love saying that because people always want to be in my business. But what does it mean? What does it mean? It means mind your business. Oh, well, oh. <laughs> next question is what's your African name? So, my name is Ama, Ama Sela. Um, Just a quick little description. If you are from Ghana, you're usually given a name the day you were born. So, my name is Ama, which is Saturday voice, the best day. Yes, yeah, shout out to Saturday. Wait, you're born? Yeah. yeah. Hey. 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 <laughs> I didn't know, but yeah, um, um, Amazon comments are the best, so I'm Amazon. <laughs> okay, like I just said, I am you didn't also the way an Amazon, but they call me Amazon B at home, so. And it's not Bia, it's B. I'm a B, as in. Like the black eyed peas, I'm a B, I'm a B. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a B. I'm a B. Oh, so, can you say something in your foreign language? Um, Let's have like a whole conversation. <laughs> Keep in mind, I am not the best at this, so you're not. I'm anti school. Not quite to Oh, school. School, Boko. School, you're Boko. Namia Dunti. Namia. Oh, gosh. You only say Namia Dunti when you're with an adult. You say that. If you're with your friends, like, hey, I'm in Namia Cross. I'm going to be catching a set. <laughs> but um yeah i just that's my part go ahead girl oh wait i, I thought we haven't gotten oh sorry, sorry but you sorry, just so. told a whole story it's fine you won it's cool next question um <laughs> Hit us up, we got you. We can do it over FaceTime. <laughs> well, yeah, that was it for our video. Make sure to like and subscribe to, yes, our to both channel. our channels. Aww. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> but make sure to subscribe to our channels. It will be in the description box, but you're already watching the channel, so don't forget to hit the description box um, to hit the subscribe button. It's free, so why not? But until then, make sure that you guys stay tuned for the next video. Bye, thanks for watching. Oh. This girl could have killed me. I like to end my videos. Yeah, I know you love like that. Layup, don't fit away. I'm going to show my head off. Some girl could have made a good look. Bye.